Everybody. Welcome back to my channel. Happy Sunday to you. Today I am bringing a makeup tutorial. Thank you to a new subscriber, Shannon, who had mentioned that she would like to see a makeup tutorial done. I actually was planning on doing another makeup tutorial because it's been a hot minute since I, I've done one. I think the last actual makeup tutorial was way at the beginning when I had a contest running. So with that said, I am bringing you a makeup tutorial today. So what am I doing? I'm doing something super simple, something that everyday person, because I am definitely a drugstore girl. I don't go out and spend a lot of money on makeup. Um, most expensive product that I buy is Revlon, and that's the color stay for the foundation. And that's about it. It made me the, the, the Revlon spray, setting spray to set the makeup after the fact. I never used to use any of this, and today I'm actually not even going to use the primer. I believe last time I had, I had like on the first video, the first makeup tutorial I had actually ever done, I used primer underneath all of it. Today I'm not, because most people don't use primer. I actually never really use primer. So I'm gonna show you. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put on the foundation so you can see what the, the and I need to go to Walmart. I mean, I, I'm almost out of like my makeups. Like these are used up, ready to go. I mean, they're they're almost they're almost empty <laughs> hey i'm scraping the bottom so i need to go to walmart today that's on my agenda but with that said i'm gonna do half of the face so you can see just for the foundation then i'll do the rest okay so super duper easy let me just open up one of these bottles like usually it comes with a pump but because i'm scraping bottom <laughs> i can't pump so let's try to get rid of this mole rat looking face. I'm just gonna do half. So I'm gonna just dot it on, you know, with this. And then I'm not gonna use a beauty blender. I sometimes will just use my fingers. I know that's so wrong, but whatever. I'm gonna use um, a blending brush. So I got these brushes off of Amazon. They're like, um, I think $11.99. And they, they actually are not bad. I mean, what do I know about a brush? I'm no beauty expert, so I'm just doing the makeup for you guys. Okay, so I just put it on. Again, I just want to do half face so you can see the coverage for Revlon, the color stay. And I use, for my skin, um, I use the combination oily, so oily and dry. So I just want to do like half face so you can kind of see what the coverage is okay from that to that not too shabby all right and then I also have the cover girl it's a uh, highlighting to put underneath the eyes I really need to stick with Revlon because cover girl liquid for some reason breaks my face out cover girl powder does not so I just put this under like I said, I'm only doing half face right now, but I'm gonna do it all and then we'll show you how to do all makeup. And I just blend it all together. Maybe I'm doing it completely wrong and I'll have a buco bunch of people saying, you're doing it wrong, but whatever, this is how I do it. <laughs> okay, so yeah, from that to that. Not too bad, not too bad. Okay, so let's just go ahead and get the other side done so I don't look like, ooh, <laughs> spooky. <laughs> All right, so let's just do the other side as well. <laughs> Obviously, come down on the neck because you certainly don't want your neck to be a different shade than your in your face <laughs> that's never a good situation <laughs> all right so just blend it all together okay I did not bring a hair tie guys winging it <laughs> Thank you. 
Okay. So then again with the color stay. When I get to doing the eyes, I can't use the, the, the camera as my mirror. I mean, yeah, like the eyes actually, like eyeshadow and stuff. That I absolutely cannot. Okay. So there you have it, right? So now, um, after you put on the foundation, I go for the CoverGirl powder. And I use, again, a brush to do the powder and just swish it around and just tap, 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 tap. Super duper easy. It does not take me long to do my face. Okay, so now powder is on. All the shine is out. I hate shiny skin. It looks disgusting to me. Oily skin just looks so gross. Um, okay, so now that is on, I need to put on the bronzer, which I buy. The Rimmel Natural Bronzer. This I need to get as well because I am hitting pan on this sucker dog. So I got my bronzing brush. And then I just kind of circulate it around in the cheeks. Maybe come up a little bit. I mean, I don't have like a super duper large forehead, so I'm not really concealing much of anything there. There we go. All right, bronzer's done. And then I use the CoverGirl um, blush. <laughs> I pretty much stick to uh, Revlon and CoverGirl, so I use my, my uh, blush, blush brush for that. And put these sucker dogs on. And one thing I like about the CoverGirl already kind of has a little bit of a highlight, but obviously I'll add just a tad more. And obviously I don't want that much. If you get too much blush, it's fine. You can always just take your powder and just go back over it like that and take off the, the stark um, pink. So now, let me do the eye okay so now we're gonna do the eyes now the eyebrows i did use that stuff that you peel so i kind of already did them otherwise i would be using like a little eyebrow stick that's what i would be using so for the eyes let's go ahead i've got the rimmel palette okay so i'm gonna make it super duper easy simple today um i got my little tissue let me get my little brush so I've got my flat brush, I don't know if you can see that, okay? And then all I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna probably use either this one or this one, and I'll use the purple at the end and then purple underneath. So I'll just put the, probably the darker one, maybe mix it up a little bit, and then put it on my, my eyes. Okay. Right. And then take another brush and blend it in and bring it up. And then if there's any fallout, just use your powder brush and just wipe underneath for the fallout okay but pretty much we want to just blend it make sure it doesn't <laughs> you don't look like bozo the clown <laughs> and blend it up I mean, there's a couple ways you can do it but for the simple simple way on the go this is how I do it now I'm gonna go into the purple 
and just go on the ends with the purple which there is some fallout there there isn't too much with rimmel okay trying to like so you can see what I'm doing here okay so then again with the brush I'm going to kind of blend it all together and go into the crease with that purple so bring it up and then of course with the fallout there we go so now I kind of created the smoky type of an eye really super quick really super quick and then with a pointier type of a brush okay, just go into the purple the same purple I used in the corner and I'm just gonna go underneath like that there we go and then if I wanted to I could take a smaller brush and maybe um, you know kind of blend that out a little bit like smoke it out a little bit you could do that I mean didn't really make much of a difference all right so that's it for the eyeshadow John now I'm gonna use the mascara you see how quick this is seriously it doesn't take a long time to do makeup I'm go ahead and put the mascara on And I'm using CoverGirl Super Sizer. That's what I'm using. And then I go underneath my eye as well. And I'm not good at doing that. <laughs> I'm good at just using the point and just gently going along the uh, lashes with the point. I am definitely not good at the other way <laughs> at all. And then, because I want to, uh, to uh, you know, line my eyes on the top, I use the L'Oreal. It, it looks like this. <laughs> they, they. I couldn't find the other one. It's got like, it's gold all the way and it's kind of skinny at one end, comes fat on the other. This is the one. This one here, you got to really be careful because it is, there's a lot going on on the brush. So you really got to be careful. I don't know if you see that, but when you're drawing this baby out, then I just draw it out like a cat eye. There you go. And then it's your discretion if you want to come up, how far you want to come up, if you want to come up, if you don't want to come up. You just want to make sure that the eyes match. <laughs> okay, so there you go. There's that. And then obviously it's got to dry. You don't want it to be all crazy. So while that's drying, I'll go ahead and put on my lipstick. So I'll just do like a fuchsia pink. And do I have a liner? No. Uh -huh. All right, and pretty much uh, hoping that's that's dry. But then we get the setting spray, the Revlon setting spray. Shake it up, spray it out. And there you go. <coughs> Super duper easy as I'm inhaling all this. <laughs> <laughs> it's got to dry so yeah it sets and it stays on even if you didn't use the setting spray the Revlon color stay makeup stays on amazing and the cover girl 
those two combinations together with the L'Oreal, that's pretty much my brands I go for. I've never really um, went past um, those two. Oh, you know what I did forget? A little bit of Wet n Wild, which the, um, uh, what do you call it? The highlighter. So really an option if you want to use the highlighter, it's your call. But you just put a little bit and then there you go. <laughs> and maybe a little bit on my nose. There you go. All right. Done. <laughs> makeup in literally eight minutes or less. <laughs> and you get a full face makeup. So it's super duper easy. Revlon for the um, foundation. I use the color stay, the 24 hour color stay. And then I use the CoverGirl um, press powder in the compact, which you can, I've used for years, you know, the little pad, or you can use a brush, or you can use whatever you use, you can use. Um, and then I use the, the CoverGirl Eye, L'Oreal for the liner. I use the CoverGirl blush, and then I use the Rimmel. Um, because it's not that expensive. The bronzer and then the Rimmel eyeshadows because I find these don't make my eyes itch. They don't make them swell up and turn pink and horrendous. So yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this video on a Sunday morning. I hope you like it and just want to give you a quick tutor tutorial to get ready with me and how I do my makeup just like that. Only takes eight minutes. So I'm not the girl that takes like an hour in a bathroom to do her makeup. I'm the girl that takes me literally five to 10 minutes to do my makeup. Usually it's about five minutes and done, we're out of here. The only reason why it took a little bit longer is because I'm talking to you. Otherwise, five minutes, this makeup, every day, done, super duper easy. With that said, I'm gonna sign out. Give me a thumbs up if you like this video. Comment down below. Let me know if there's any other makeup tutorials you would like me to do for you. Um, my newbies who just joined in, I thank you so, so, so very much. And all my current subscribers, I love you from the bottom of my heart. And all my newbies from the bottom of my heart, my heart goes out to you. Boom, boom, boom. I have a beating heart for you. <laughs> and if you're not yet subscribed and you want to be subscribed, go ahead and smash that subscribe button down below. Alrighty, guys, turn on the bell for notifications so you know these videos are coming out. Until the next time, peace.